Bruh. Guys, I think I'm addicted to this. It's not good. It's never good. What are you gonna do? Time to get to work. Let's go. Probably the worst at moving. Still got boxes to bring to the house. Sad, right, let's get to work, yo. Ooh. It's gonna be a nice day, a nice busy day. I don't know if you guys have a Wawa. If you watching this and you have a Wawa, that's, yo, the breakfast sandwiches. Not the Sizzlies, like the, um, and then I, I wouldn't call them breakfast sandwiches. It's the, the pretzel bagels got me hooked, man. That turkey ranch bacon, uh, pretzel bagel. I've been slacking on, uh, the diet, as you can see. But, yo, real quick, let me stop this truck real quick. I want to show y'all something. Look at this. These just came in, the Die Legend hat, uh, dad hats. Dad legend, dad hats. Let me know what you guys think about the dad hats, man. Let me show you what I'm talking about. This is what I get. So good. It's so good. Check mic, one, two, one, two. We're in, in the building. I already ordered, bro. Jimmy, Jimmy John's, John's, man. Sorry. I'm so, of, I'm so sick of Jimmy John's. Bro. I'm sick of them, too. Lunch meat is really bad for you, too. Yeah. It's cool. You're not supposed to eat all the time. Lunch meat it builds like a, it has like a bacteria on it. That's why when you're pregnant, you're not supposed to eat lunch meat. Ah, that's right. Hey, Mike, do me a favor. something. Hold this camera on this side. I had an appointment coming in in two minutes. Do you really? No. Would you put canola oil on this? This is so greasy. <laughs> Golly. I like how y'all get real quiet. That's how it needs to be every time I speak. <laughs> uh, I need you to record this side, not that side. I understand that. Let me do my job. You do your thing, let me do my thing. Jeff, get out of my shot. You're overcasting. <laughs> You're overcasting shadow. <laughs> Appreciate that, Jeff. That is the quiet before the storm. Let's start getting ready. Tripod set up. And a few things we have doing here. And, uh, it's still light outside. 8 o'clock starts the, uh, the free event. So, let's see how it goes. So you guys, and you guys, um, you guys can see the live stream of this event. This is us just kind of networking and catching up and chatting it up and stuff. And, uh, we brought the halo light, the halo light so that we can see my man cutting here. And I think today was a success, man. It was a good time. So thanks for everyone who showed up to the live event, and thank everybody who showed up to uh, the live stream. So let me know what y'all thought about it. I ain't gonna lie, I'm tired. Last night, got home late. My son's sixth birthday, so I had to stay up a little bit later. Um, play with him for a little bit. I'm not dreading going to work. I'm excited. I'm tired. I'm excited, man. I'm already thinking about who, who can, whose cut can I record for a tutorial. Got him. Got him. Back in the game, baby. Went on my other one, too. Appreciate you all with that life on thing. I appreciate you. You're small. You're small. That's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all guess, guess what's back guys, we got it back, back in commission, Fonzo sent out, how many of these you sent out Fonz? I won't be able to go for uh, eight. eight, two, two LIs and six pros. And we got them all back and they all working, customer service was great. Yes, uh, depend, depends on the rep, I'm not even going to lie, because one rep, uh, what I previously called, 
told me that I have to have receipts for them to take care of the ones that had a warranty. But then when I called back, uh, that the, the other rep didn't tell me that. They just said that as long as it has the number on the system, get out of here. <laughs> gotcha. Send them out without blades. Oh, we got new blades. We got new blades. Oh, cool. So they'll, they'll hook you up with new blades. Make sure you uh, on the low. I mean, I'm, we're not giving that advice. That might that, that might be illegal. We're not giving that advice. We're just saying that if you don't have blades, they'll hook it up. Yeah. Oh, and another thing, I sent out my shavers. It was a month after the warranty was over, and they still honored it. So big that was dope. Andy's. Thank you. Thank you, Andy's. For... Yeah, and I, I I just um got my hands on this, this company right here. Shapu, 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 Shapu blades. So far, I haven't compared them to uh, the ones I like. I like these. But we're gonna we're gonna match them up. We're gonna make a video and match them up. Also got these. These are some hitters right here. Rockwell, though, you guys are trying, man. You guys are, are working hard. I do think you can make these a little sharper. I think you guys did it did it right with 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 this one at first, but it's been consistent lately. Lately they're not that sharp. But awesome packaging. What happened? What happened, JP? Oh wow. Wow, customers that takes the clippers off the station. Dang, cleaning himself up in the mirror. Disrespectful. Dang. Was the hair sticking out still? <laughs> yeah, so it's a dance, bro. So it's a, come on. You're doing so good. Come on. Come on, we need views. The blog needs views. Come on. Come on. He cold. <laughs> John, why is this razor so small, bro? You got small hands, bro. Wow, bro, you gonna talk about your hands like that? John, you got small hands. This is a regular, like, plastic cheap razor. This thing is tiny. Right next to a, a 245 shave gel. Look at this. Smallest razor blade I've ever seen in my life. John, why is this next strip on the station? I'm gonna have to delete this part. <laughs> Yo, JP and I agree that this guy right here looks Nate's daddy. We call his dad, bro. John, you ready? Watch this. Alright, that's him. Right, let's go look at let's go look at Nate. Real quick. What's going on? I'll let you guys decide. You guys judge. Does he look just like Eddie Santiago or what? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> he's, like, he's like, what's going on? Hey, what's up, you two? I just want to introduce you guys to my own personal pilot, Isaac, my pilot. Isaac, what's the favorite thing about flying? Um, the adrenaline. The adrenaline? Yeah. I don't want to have any adrenaline in um, flying with you. <laughs> I just want you to take me to my destination and that's it. Well, that's me hard to do. Okay. That's Isaac, the, my personal pilot. Hey, me, bro. You have to. So today's kind of a sad day, man, because. Um, One for my father. We got um, Jeff. He, he's been filling in for like a few weeks now. And he that we needed his help. So today's his last day. He's going back to the same team location. So the guys are, you know, they're spraying their air hoses in memory of Jeff. Jeff, love you, bro. Well, you're before we talk about your hug. Area. Definitely book my boy, Mr. Jeff himself. For Jeff, though, right? Always. Always. Just one day, though. <laughs> what? Alright, Saturday's up. For some reason, we always end up listening to some freestyles. King Los. Alright, Jeff. I can't say Confederate flag. I'm gonna keep saying you, bro. What? Fonz, why you copying me, bro? What do you mean, bro? No, oh, I originated this swag. You wish you had it, bro. And you originated the swag on your head, too? Yep. What hat is that? 
<laughs> See, I, what I did is I went and um, I thought of this idea, this great idea. Oh <laughs> this barber culture, okay? And, uh, you know, I always told myself that I wanted, I wanted to die a legend, you know? And uh, I, I started doing some, some research about Egyptian culture. Oh. Sounds good. <laughs> It sounds, it sounds legit. Sounds legit. So, you know, sometimes you gotta do that. And, you know, Chris started seeing that I was I was doing that. I know, Mike, it's, it's coming in, I know. So, he saw the swag that I was bringing to the barbershop. He's like, damn, I wanna, I wanna do that. I was like, Chris, go ahead, man. I, I'll let you take some of my swag. <laughs> Mama don't play that. Mama don't play that. <laughs> Why are you all up in the face? Because you all up in my... This menu? We look at this menu because you're cheap as hell. So we look at the cheap menu. Okay. Because daddy's cheap. And then what else? What, what, and then we look at this one. And too. then we look at the cheap drink. So, no. Boy, dear. We have an angry female. Her name is Christine. Caroline. You get too close to her. You get very angry. <laughs> I'm not gonna hide you, girl. I'm not gonna hide you. Oh my God. <laughs> Notice as she rolls her eyes in anger. That's a telltale sign that you better back off, fellow, or you're gonna get bad. <laughs> so everybody got some 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 alcoholic beverages. Oh, oh, oh. You got it? Yeah, I got it. <laughs> Hell, boy. <laughs> Look at the scorpion. Yo, who is balling and got the scorpion? I got to know. Who's balling? Baller alert. Baller alert. Wow. Yeah, okay, player. That is so cool. <laughs> oh, scared you guys. Here we go. That's the turn up juice. Uh, look, look. Okay, this is really super long. Watch your spot. Woo! Oh, right there. Good. Oh, now she's fine. Did you drink? Look at the face. No, it's really so good. Six, six, ten. Somebody's scared. Scared of the fire. Legoland tomorrow. So most people get to go home, but because we have a baby, we gotta get some diapers. And it's gotta be hugging. Diapers are expensive. If you're young, you can save a lot of money by not having kids. Just saying. We had our kids. I was 21. Justine was 20 when uh, Elijah was born. Three years later, we had Valentina. Two kids. Now I'm 27. She's 26. We're young. By the time. By the time we just touch 40, there'll be, you know, adults pretty much. I guess that's something to look forward to. I have a CVS card. And I know they got a CVS card behind the counter. This is just me being cheap. But we got a CVS card over here. Um, Justine has one. I try to punch my number in, but I'm not in the system. But I know, instead of him letting me come all the way to the parking lot to get the CVS card, he could have scanned his own card. He could have trusted me scan his own card so I could save two bucks on the diapers. He chose not to, 
So, whatever. That's the total opposite of what I want to be when it comes to dealing with customers with 245 or with headlines, anything like that. Like, come on. She just had Kobe Steakhouse. Like, a lot of food at Kobe Steakhouse. Alright, today is Sunday, and um, Lodge, where are we going today? To Legoland. To Legoland? Dantino, will you get over here, girl? Hey. So today I'm not going to be recording, because I'm unplugging. Unplugging today is Sunday, it's Lodge's birthday weekend, we're going to Legoland, so I'm unplugging. See you guys tomorrow. Yo, alright, so a lot got done today. Got the kids in the bath right now, they're taking a bath. We worked on the house all the way till about 4 o'clock. Picked up my kids. My mom did me an awesome favor and watched them while Justine's in school. Justine's in school, cutting hair. Then I went, I picked up some furniture that we're going to use to stage the house. Met up with Danny. We uh, we worked for like an hour working on like brainstorming and, and getting a checklist done of things we need to get done. We also talked about the barber session. In that hour, we were very productive. We even have a agenda of exactly how we're gonna set up the barber session, which will be January 15th. So that's set up and we're not done. Obviously from here till then, it's like a month, like a month and two weeks from now. We'll kind of manipulate the plan a little bit to work best for the class because we want to give the best class that we could possibly give. About 10, 15 minutes, I got a meeting with Danny and another guy that we're working on, an idea that we have. In between that time, I'm gonna be getting the kids out of the bath, in their pajamas, and ready for bed. So that by nine o'clock, they'll be in bed, going to sleep. So tomorrow, they'll, they'll have plenty of energy. They usually go to bed at 8.30, but uh, we've been working, we've been working. Being a daddy and an entrepreneur at the same time. It ain't easy, but gotta figure it out. You gotta find the yes, you gotta figure out how, how to get it done. There's no excuses, right? It's official. Who's back there? Kind of here. And of course, you gotta bring out the you guys license. Size, gym. He passed the, the barber exam, the barber's Shape board gym. exam. My man is cutting now. He's in the shop. Congrats to, uh, congrats to you, Drake. It's official. You a headlines barber. There's the last clip of this vlog. The last clip? There's the last clip right here of the vlog. Well, I wanna say that I'm excited for uh, 2017. Big no, things coming up. Not 17. the last vlog, the last clip. Last, no, but I'm just saying, you know, I just want, what we're going to do for this project? What project? The next one, man. The next video. I call them projects, man. All right, signing out. Vlog's over. To the next one.